Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, we'll see how to connect to Maximo database, okay, using the Beaver application. Okay, so it's a common application used to connect to many databases as you want, okay, like DB2, MySQL, SQL, and so on. Let's see step by step how to install it and connect it to Maximo database, okay. So let's run this application, okay. Make sure to download it, it's free, okay. We will go to installation step by step and install DB2 driver. Then we will connect it to Maximo database. See how to query it. Okay, so it's let's install it next. Okay, next. Okay, once installation is uh, once system, uh, the application is installed, you need some information like host. Uh, uh, your uh, uh, database instance admin and password and your board you can get this information from your database administrator okay so you can connect to maximo database and uh, run your query and so on okay so finished now it's finished so let's open it For first time, it will take some time. So this application has a good community. You can work with it. It's a, there is a free addition. Okay, now it's opening. Okay, after opening, okay, you will see this message. If you need a sample database, but we don't need sample database for now. Okay, make sure to choose no. This all databases you can choose from DB2, MySQL, uh, Oracle, SQL Server, and so on. A lot of databases you can connect with them. Any database you will connect you need a server, okay? Host server and need database to connect with. So we choose DB2. Here we need our host and need port, need database name and username for database instance and also password. This information you can get it from your database administrator. Okay. So I will enter this information. Also, you need a driver, DB2 driver. You can get it from your source application or you can download it. Now I, I install, I added, okay, my information here, my host and username and password. Okay, that's all for my machine. Then test the connection and then click finish. After finish, you will connect to Maximum Database. If you have any problem uh, in test the connection, you can uh, you can get it and solve this problem with your database administrator. Make sure. To validate this information, make sure it's valid, nothing, no problem with it. Now it's maximum database, max db76. Okay, it contains all your schema, your tables, and views, and so on. Okay, let's try to uh, create query to test that our database is correct and our connection is healthy and well. So we can select from a uh, select all users already exist on the system. Okay. 
Okay, we have a max user table. Okay, that contains all users on the system. So let's run this query. Okay, get the result. These all users already exist on the system. Okay, that's all guys for this video. If you want more videos like this, kindly tell me in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe, share it with your friends. Okay, thank you. See you later.